This year brought a new element to the CMA Music Festival, the inaugural Tug McGraw Foundation Celebrity Sporting Clay Shootout. Artists gathered at the Nashville Gun Club to help benefit military service members affected by post-traumatic stress disorder and traumatic brain injury. Kelly was at the club to chat with a few artists before the shootout, which has also been described as golf with shotguns. My little brother, Mark McGraw, really put this together. You know, he's done a great job. He, he wanted to do an event this year and try, tried to find the right time to do it, a time when I was around so I could show up and, and be a part of it and a time when a lot of artists were in town. So CMA Fest worked out great. And, I, you know, he's, he's the guy that put this together and, and did a great job, and I'm proud of him. Caught up with Craig Campbell here today on this beautiful day to shoot some clay pigeons. How are yeah. you for a great cause? Clay pigeons, yes. Uh, the Tug McGraw Foundation. It's uh, you know, last year I, I was uh, I was out on tour with Willie, so I didn't get to do any of the cool stuff for CMA Week. Being on tour with Willie's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it was it was. <laughs> if, if I'm going to be doing something else, why not let it just you know be on tour with Willie? But uh, I'm I'm excited about today. Today's a lot of fun. A lot of uh, a lot of my buddies I get to see, and and uh, we're just going to shoot some stuff. Now, a lot of guys with guns scares me typically, and this is the first year that you guys have gotten together to do this. So, do you think everybody's going to get real competitive, or? I absolutely. We're, we're. You said a lot of guys with guns. Um, we're, we're, we're professionals. So we're professional uh, singers. What do you have going on? Because this is CMA week. It's going to be really super busy. Uh, after this, after we're done shooting guns, it, it goes straight to Crazyville. It's, uh, you know, signing remotes. I think I'm playing two or three shows. It's just, uh, it, it's sun up to sundown. And, you know, that's what this week is about. You know, it's about the fans and it's about getting out and, and, and meeting new people and, uh, you know, just kind of doing it to, to the fullest. So uh, I'm busy straight up till we leave at uh, 10 o'clock on Thursday and then we're back Sunday for some, for some more of it. Mr. J.T. Hodges here. How are you? How are you, darling? I'm good. This is going to be a great day. Beautiful day. Coming out for a really good cause. And how did you get involved today? I know Tug McGraw Foundation, Tim McGraw. Uh, actually, you know, my manager was uh, really good friends with the, in the McGraw family. And when he told me about this actually last year, I said, man, if we can get an opportunity to do that, I'd love to do that. You know, anytime you can have some fun, shoot some guns for a good cause, uh, you know, like post-traumatic stress disorder and traumatic brain injury, we just have no idea what these, these military folks go through. And more veterans have committed suicide since 2001 than we have fighting on the battlefields of Iraq and Afghanistan. I've been dealing with um, post-traumatic stress for about five years now. Um, my, my particular situation um, knocked me out of service in uh, November of 2007. And um, since then, I've been in uh, two residential treatment programs. And uh, I've, got, I've got the best help from uh, the program that the Tug McGraw Foundation sponsors. It's called the Pathway Home. It's a total of 1.5 million Americans are living with us. Beyond the emotional pain endured by these individuals and the families, the total lifetime treatment cost is about $3.3 trillion. I can only speak for myself because each case is, is you know, is, is tailor-made. You know, there's, there's, you know, lots of telltale signs and things like that. But each individual is going to go and walk down his own road. Anytime we can do something for the troops, you know, we jump at the chance. You know, it's near and dear to our heart, and that's what our charity is involved in doing as well. So we're excited to be here and, and just glad it's for a good cause. I'm glad to do uh, anything that, that revolves around uh, supporting the soldiers, and, and especially the guys that have fought for this country and, and you know, paid a price for it. And, uh, you know, th this is a great event. It raises a lot of money, and uh, hopefully it helps. Who out here would you like to beat today? Uh, Luke Bryan. <laughs> Why is that? Because he's probably going to be the easiest to beat. <laughs> you know, you always, you always go for the weakest link, and he's probably the weakest link, so that's the one I'm going to go for. How did you get involved, and are you really good at shooting guns? Is I, this going to be real competitive? Well, I do love to shoot. Uh, matter of fact, I've had some crow issues at my house in, in inner city of Dallas, so I, I've, I've been wanting to find a place I can take the aggression out because I can't shoot them in the inner city where I live. Uh, so I'm, I'm looking forward to taking some of these clay pigeons out and uh, and just to make, I'm trying to make myself, uh, convince myself that, that they're crows. Okay, and, and so I, work. I'm pretty sure I'll be 100% uh, on, on today. today. All right, I've caught up with Luke Bryan, who Mr. Tim McGraw just said, uh, Luke Bryan is the guy to beat. So well, what do you say to that? Uh, well, you know, I'm, I'm, 
hey, I, you know, I got a presence out here. No, I, you know, I don't know. I ain't shot in a while, but we're going we're gonna to have a good time out here. And like I said, it's all for a good cause, and we're just enjoying being here. All right. He, he made the comment, Louisiana against Georgia. Hey, so. I don't know. We can go. Get, we can do that. <laughs> We've got lots more ahead, so don't go away. We're checking out an event next that really gets the fans closer to their favorite artists. We'll be right back with more Inside Music Row.